I thought you said you were gonna get us a girl to party with. I'm working on it, man. I'm working on it. Yeah, yeah. A girl to party with. What do you think? They just fall out of trees or something? Just need a hang tight, I'm telling you. We're gonna find one to play with tonight. Where you think you're going, girl? came through here. The trail just ends. You know what? You wait here. We're gonna go find this bitch.
two. Two zero two. Two zero two, go ahead. Unit two zero two, respond out to Route One near the swamps. Meet with the complainant. It's gonna be Willie Bob. He's probably gonna be intoxicated. He's trying to report some kind of suspicious incident. Two zero two copy. En route from Bear Creek Road. All right, two zero two. I copy. Zero nine forty five hours. You. you don't sneak up on a cop like that. That's how you get shot. I didn't sneak up on you. I walked up behind you. You couldn't have called my name from over there? Well, I suppose I could have, but I didn't. All right? Touche. Okay. I've checked this whole area, and I haven't seen anything. So tell me what you saw. No, it ain't about what I saw. It's about what I heard. With my ears. How much have you been drinking today? I mean, I've had a little bit, yeah, but who hadn't? Do you know what time it is? I ain't got to watch them. I mean, but you, did, you didn't see nothing out there. It's 10 a.m. Well, okay. Yeah. And? All right. Well, I, mean, I ain't had as much as I usually have by 10 a.m. I'm going to tell you that right now because I was a little worried. All the screaming and yelling I heard. I mean, this is what I heard. There was some yelling and some screaming. It sounded like somebody was getting killed out here. Okay. All right. Well, I didn't see anything and I didn't hear anything. And I'm, quite frankly, tired of coming out here for all your things that you see well and I mean here. when was the last time you came out here for something that, that I that I saw the that wasn't legitimate the unicorns last week okay well when besides that time when when did you come out here the clowns the week before okay but well you know what all right well just if you would please just you know if you find somebody out here tell them to, to don't be screaming and yelling because they're disturbing my drinking time I gotta go I'm going back to the house. Okay, you stay at home. It's good you, to you see you. You drink at home. It's good to see you. It's never good to see you. But it's good to see you. Please go home. And walk. I'm going home. Don't drive. No, you, you, I'm going. Do you see a car? Go home. I'm walking my own two feet. If I see you again today, I'm arresting you. If I see you again today, I'm going to give you a big old kiss. Go away. Got you coffee, Vera. Put the shovel down. Whoa, I'm not after you. I'm not after you. What are you doing out here? 
I'm digging for worms for fishing. I'm gonna need to see some ID. Now. Okay. Two oh three, two oh two. Two oh three, two two oh two. Can you take me to them? Them? Okay, let's go. Coming for you, my dear. Body parts everywhere. Rivera, dead people. Dead okay. people. Okay, okay. Body. Okay. Rivera, I've been a deputy for three years and I ain't never seen no shit like okay. this. Okay, okay. It's okay. just crazy. Calm down, Calm down. Breathe. craziness. Breathe. Breathe. Deep breath. Out. In. Okay. You good? Yeah. Alright. Can you show Definitely. me? I just I just got good and you want me to show you? Show me. Oh, come on.
always doing stupid shit. Not unicorns. Not this time. All right, you put the tape up. I'm gonna have to call the sheriff. All right. Move. I'm trying to put. I'm trying to put the tape up. Look what you did. Look. Did you answer? No. Well, why not? I don't know. I'm not there. He's probably drunk. That's what I'd be doing. Roscoe, stay here. I'm gonna go down to the office and see if I can't find the sheriff. Okay. You're leaving me out here with all these all these body parts. Yeah, you better call the state police. I don't want to deal with this. This ain't right. This is the Raven's Neck Sheriff's Department. We are unable to take your call at this time. Please leave a message and the tone. Sheriff? Sheriff? Sheriff. Sheriff. Dad! Good morning. Morning, sunshine. Is that necessary? It is if I want to function, yes. I've been trying to call you. No. Didn't hear it. We have a crime scene. A big one. A big one? Where? Down by the swamp. There are body parts everywhere. Body? Body parts? Body what? parts. <sighs> I always like this picture. Uh, how many? That is yet to be determined. More than one person. More than one person. And you're drunk. You remember when you made this for me? Are you kidding me right now? Do you even hear a word that I said? And what is this? Oh, some goofy ass politician's kids got herself lost. That we have a crime scene with body parts and there's a missing persons on your desk? Don't you think this could be related? Now I do. Okay, when the mayor gets here for this party, he's also going to want to know about the body parts. Are you going to be able to talk to him? Maybe. Dad, mm. you were the sheriff, and I need you to do your job and be the sheriff today. Okay. Well, first thing to do is to delegate. Uh, 
you go back to the crime scene, get up our fancy black and yellow tape, and take all those pictures and everything, and we'll get it written up later. Because right now I've got other things that are on my mind. And you go home and shower because you smell terrible. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. And I shave and please put on a clean shirt. And you be ready when I come back so that you can meet the mayor. Oh, God. Yeah, man. yeah uh, medical examiner. Get. What's, what's her name? The pushy broad. What's her name? God. The, the, the. You shower. Huh? And answer your phone. Uh, just like her mother, a real firecracker. Couldn't hit a bull in the butt with a bass fiddle, but uh, got plenty of fire. Oh, damn. There's sprinkles down in here. Yeah. Yeah, I'm holding. Yeah, can you get me somebody who actually knows where this place is? No, I'm not drinking. I'm in a freaking cornfield. Or whatever you people call these freaking things. And there's like a big tower on one side of me. Well, you, you got my number, all right? Call me back. No, you don't call me back. Get somebody who knows where I'm supposed to be to call me back with the right directions. I'm going to keep heading down this road, go back to town. You, you know what? I don't care either way. I've already been paid. It's your messed up directions. It's your event. It's on you. If I'm late, I'm late. You know how hard it is to piss in a clown suit? Sheriff, have you met my new personal assistant, Betty? Betty, Sheriff, Sheriff, Betty. Now, Sheriff, I want to get down to the brass tacks. Uh, I understand there's been a situation down by the swamp. Now, what do we know? Well, uh, my deputy told me that there are quite a few body parts down there. Your deputy? Your daughter? Yes, that's the best one I know. Hmm. Parts... What parts? She wasn't specific. She just said body parts. I imagine there's the usual assortment. She said there's more than one person, though. Uh, how she knows that, I don't know. I am expecting her to update me very soon uh, with what she's found and what could have caused it. How soon? That, I don't know. Well, now, I am sure it's just some uh, boating accident. Or a lawnmower malfunction. If you get my drift. <coughs> yeah. 
Well, the investigation is ongoing. I have my best personnel on the job. And I am sure that she will be getting back to me as soon as possible. Oh, and by the way, what are you doing about the evictions down at the swamp? Uh, almost all of them, except for Willie Bob and a few of the colored folk down by Chicken Cove. Not all of them. Uh, not all of them, yeah. How soon are we going to take care of that? Well, I do have to divert people to take care of this accident. Now, you know I've got that Texas investor coming into town soon. As a matter of fact, he's going to be here this week. Mm -hmm. He wants to invest a lot of money into Raven's Neck so that we can have malls, uh, uh, restaurants, uh, uh, payday loan stores, uh, jobs. Why don't you sell those eviction notices as kind of a, an incentive? Mayor, you know there's talk in the town of, about the swamp being sacred ground for the colored folks. You remember what happened there? I'm not going to let some unfortunate incident in the past have an effect on my town today. Now, my great-grandfather, God rest his soul, he may have been misguided, but he thought he was doing the right thing. Tell you what we do. I will authorize a Remember the Slaves Memorial right beside the dollar store in the new mall if it'll make them hush up. Okay. How does that sound? Sheriff's office. Yeah. Really? Okay. All right, well, I will be getting back with you. Yeah. All right, thank you. Bye. That was my daughter. She said that after the coroner finished throwing up everything he's eaten for the last week, they've determined that it appears to be an animal attack. Animal attack? Well, well that's good. No, 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 that's not good. But, but well, did she say what kind of animal? Based on what they found, um, bites and stuff, they think it's crocodile. A really big one. Well, I will be very interested to see what sort of strategy you come up with. Uh, and I will see you at my wife's birthday party. You know she is fond of you. Come on, Betty. Bye, Sheriff. Clown? I'm not an ass clown. You're an ass clown. All of you are ass clowns. I asked you to give me good, decent directions. Do you even know where this place is at? You're the one that hired me, okay? <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna pull over and I'm gonna sit on the side of the road until I can talk to somebody who can give me good, decent directions. All right? No. No, I'm, I'm sitting here, I'm waiting. And I still got a piss! Bye.
Myrtle? Myrtle's a sheriff. Myrtle! This is the sheriff. Patch me through to uh, Abigail's phone. Tom, okay? Myrtle, is she answering yet? Abby, uh, we got a problem again. Uh, Dad. Dad. You know, I just got to sleep good. I was up all night. Well, the mayor has called in some researchers, and they're down by the swamp with Roscoe. And you know how he handles things. All right, Dad. Get on down there and take charge of him. Make sure he doesn't do what he usually does. I swear to God, if you don't put the instructions on the soul, he couldn't pour water out of a boot. Why can't you go? I can't go because somebody over at Morningside Cemetery has dug up some bodies, and I have got to go over there and see what in the name of hell is going on. I swear to God, the town has gone straight to hell in a handbasket in just under 24 hours. All right, then. Are we on the way? I'm going to be able to make the birthday party. <laughs> I need help. I don't know where I am. I don't know what it was. Hello? Uh. Over the swamp, yes. 
Abby, we got one hell of a mess here. We got at least three graves dug up. That's right. Thank you very much. I got a little something I just want to sing for you. you ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Mildred. Happy birthday to I got you a special gift because I know it's your favorite. All right? I, will buy I know it's your favorite. Now you should I know, I know. Happy birthday, dear. Oh, I got, I got business to attend to, but I'll be back. Oh, no. All right, now, honey, you hurry back now. Oh, my God. Look at that. So look at that. Nice. Wow, y'all, can I get some? You're so nice. Go, buddy. Where's that clown? Now, you said there was going to be a clown here, and huh? I haven't seen him. Clown's not here. Should have been here by now. Well, I know, but you know how clowns are. They have no sense of timing. It ain't party unless there's a clown. Well, you know you're absolutely right, Dumpling. Yeah, she's right. Ain't no party without a clown. <laughs> you're you know, right. You no, know, I have a clown. You're right. Yeah, you're right, Melody. I know she got home phone with him. Yeah. He'll be here shortly, okay? Well, Just good. I can't about, wait for don't him. Don't worry about dumping. It's all going to be good. Well, I can't wait for him. Papa Chicken, you were not invited to this party. Happy birthday, Miss Mill. Well, I thank you. Thank you. Not the chicken? 
it. Ain't you gonna open it? Yeah. Yeah. Open. Yeah. Open. Open. Open, open, open it up. Open it up. Well, you gotta yeah, see what it. it is. I don't wanna see. Open it up. What is it? What is it? I don't know. Oh, what is it? Oh, 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 my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Quite a party, Mr. Mayor. Quite a party. You and your voodoo killed my wife. You ruined the party. So now I'm going to kill you. Oh, 
like this to me. Rest in pieces. <laughs> This stuff is cool. Yeah. Yeah, we don't have nothing like that around here. Okay. All right. So, how is this gonna catch a crop? Okay. So, this is how it's gonna go. Bah! And then the crack's gonna appear. And then the cage. Any questions? So what you tapping? Ash, can you go interview him or something? Yeah. You want to interview me? Yeah. I ain't never been on TV before. All right, so tell me what you found in the swamp. Well, we showed up and there were just, there were body parts everywhere. It, it was, I ain't never seen no shit like that. Can, can I say that? Am I allowed to say shit? I oh. can cut it out. Sorry. All right. Well, it was like something out of a bad horror movie. Guys. Guys, come here. It's right here. Let's hop out. Ah. Mama who? Mama Ko. Ah. Timbabi Dibabooter. Where's he going? Let's go get the goat. For what? The demonstration I just showed you. Oh. Right. You gonna let the croc eat the goat? Yeah. Well, that just, that just ain't right. I just... I don't know how I feel about letting that go get eaten while it's alive, you know? I was on TV, Revere. I guess it really liked the goat.
Mataya Bio Bay. Okay, guys, he thinks it's safe. It went underwater. Hmm. Tell me what that was. Well, we were here to catch a crocodile and clearly that's not a crocodile. You wanna tell me what that was? I just filmed shit. So you're a fraud. Look, my partner just died and my dad's running around here somewhere. Okay, we're gonna go this way and we're gonna try to avoid that thing. If you're not gonna be any help, just shut up and follow me. I don't know, she was right there.
quiet. Sorry. Are you gonna draw that thing out and it's gonna kill your friend? You know what? We can just leave. We're not even really friends. She can find her own way out. There's her hat. you I'll explain everything on the way let's go here you'll need this that's yours follow me I'm going with him Crocodile Jack. And I've been hunting crocs and gators in this swamplands for a long time now. What is this thing? This thing is 35 feet of undead reptilian terror. I lived here my whole life and I've never seen anything like that before. Somebody around here has pissed off one of the voodoo priests. There's dark magic afoot. This thing is resurrected for revenge. And it's going to eat its way through your town. And I don't give a shit about your town. I have a score to settle. Now come on. I tell you, dark magic. What are they? Zombies. 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 The living dead, the resurrected. Like eat your brain zombies? Not just your brains, they'll eat everything. But yeah, that's what we're up against. 
Aim for the head. Give me a gun. I got mine. I got mine too. I'm working on it. You're supposed to be hunting this thing. It looks like it's hunting us. This is part of my plan. Oh, you have a plan. <laughs> Great plan. It's not that simple. Each one of these voodoo creatures has a certain way of dying. We got this plan. What part do we play in it? Your bait. Spread out. Keep your eyes open. What are we looking for? Looking for anything that that voodoo priest might have hidden out here. Definitely crocodile. <laughs>
What are we doing? We need to get out of here. We need to call someone in for help. Maybe you need help. We've got this covered. Does this look like we have it covered? I gotta find my dad. All right, we'll go this way. Kill this thing. Now.
They sent the slaves into the swamps to be eaten by crocodiles. That's why the voodoo priest is doing this. That makes sense. We need to find him. Have any idea where we can find him? Must be Willy Bob's moonshine stash. See another local. Yeah. Is that any good? The blood's gonna attract the crop. Thanks. Why don't you get some rest? The rain stops, we're gonna have to Female. There's no way these things are hatching. Wait, I've got a better idea. Darila! Darila! Ah! 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 Ah!
Why you still can? No, if that's gonna help. <laughs> ah. ah. Yeah. Yeah. It's not gonna work. I don't. I don't. Yeah. I, don't I don't know what to do. I just need to take this. Uh. Secret. Secret for killing this. Killing this beast. That's. That's. It's what? Oh. What's the secret? <sighs> the secret? What are we talking about? The, the secret to killing the croc. Oh. Yeah. The tooth. You need. You need. To, Fuck!
Now you will feel the rapture. Destroy the heart. <laughs> 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 